All right, guys, so continuing our little adventure into the mountains here, we uh, we finally found a pack of wolves, but unfortunately, these are not in the right region. These are in the Door Apex region. They're not in the uh, the Regina Mountains, so I don't think it's going to matter. Um, they're only about 350 yards out. I mean, we could chance it. We also have a herd of Mouflon. Where did they go? There they go. There they are right there. Right there. So I don't know if I should risk getting one of the wolves because we only need a female wolf. But I'm, I'm really tempted to see if we have any decent mouflon down there. So what we'll do is we're going to check these mouflon out first. And because, uh, you know, our, our lodge here is really lacking. So that's what I want to do. I want to check out these mouflon and see if there's anything decent in this herd. Because we haven't found any really big mouflon yet. And uh, I'd really like to... Now, we also had a herd of chamois, like, right up there that we spooked out here. I had no idea they were there. This is actually a pretty cool little spot, I must say. And it looks like those wolves are possibly just chilling out. I mean, we got one there just kind of bedding down. I think they should be resting now. And then there's another one that just laid down. So yeah, we'll definitely uh we'll definitely go back to those guys later on. He looks like he's walking down to the water. So I don't really want to get too close to the water's edge. Um the wind could be a lot better. I'm really worried about just tumbling down this hill and spooking everything. <laughs> but unfortunately we need to get close enough to get a spot on these guys. And I just heard more cracking. No, I guess that was just ambient. Like I say, I don't know how much noise we're making here. <laughs> Gosh, you got to get so close to get the spotting to work. And I am just right out in the open. Like I said, I, I don't feel that sight is too big of an issue in this game. It's really all about the noise you make. Okay, he's just a one star. What do we have here? One star. One star mature. Gosh, none of these are... None of these are decent. Where are all the big mouflon at, man? Hmm. I mean, we could take out that one star male, but... I guess... I could turn my attention to the wolves to see what we have over there. If I can find out where they are even. So the wolves are on the move again. Hmm. Like I say, I really wish that we had some decent move line. I don't know where to find them. Probably up in the area that's uh, that's locked to us at the moment. I really would like to get that unlocked and hunt those mountains, but I have a long way to go before I can get money for that. And like I said, the only way to unlock it is to get those wolves in the Regina Mountains. But like I said, this is not the Regina Mountains. So... I have no idea if this is going to work for us or not. And of course, I cannot see what these wolves are. 
I get pretty close to him before we can get a spot on him. I need to get two females. So, there's two female wolves in the Regina Mountain. See, that's... That's the thing. I have never seen wolves in there. This is the first time I've seen wolves in the mountain areas. But we're going to go check them out regardless because there might be a decent wolf in here. And I have yet to see like a really good mature wolf as well. So hopefully we'll, uh, we'll find something decent today. Mature female. Okay, so she's a, uh, she's a contender for the mission. Young female. Mature female. Dang. What's that one there? Adult female. Where are all the mature males? I'm seeing just... On both maps, man, I'm seeing a ton of adult males and young males. I have not found one mature male wolf yet. It's very strange. I'm sure it has something to do with their lifespan. One star adult. See, I see one star adult. Adult female. Okay. Oops. Is she on the move, actually? No. We got her down quick. All right. So let's see here. Did we spook these guys? I don't think we did. We didn't. One star adult. About 300 out. Let's see if we can't possibly take one of these guys as well. I think it's him right there. Well, let's mark that blood. Where, hmm, I kind of feel like he went down right over there in the water. All right. So there we go. We got two animals down. We'll, uh, we'll go pick up a female gray wolf here. I, I don't think it's going to add. I kind of hope it does because I really think that maybe this mission is bugged because uh, the Regina Mountains, I mean, we're here. We're very close. The Regina Mountains are just here over this line uh so i don't know i don't know how how specific that they uh they wanted to be in the regina mountains it would be nice to uh harvest her and see that add to it because now at least i know where there's one wolf pack um like i said i have need zones in the regina mountains i've hunted them several times and i just I can't find any wolves. They, they just they never show up at the need zones for whatever reason. It's very strange because, you know, on both maps, pretty much if you hunt the need zones, um, you will eventually find them sometime. You know, it may not be at the, uh, the exact time that they're supposed to be there, but uh, some point in that day, you will see animals there. And the actual zone from the map, the, uh, the glowing ground, isn't there anymore so that's peculiar to me because it's still showing up on the map but yeah the uh the actual need zone that you can see with the hundred cents isn't showing up so i have no idea what's going on there all right let's pick her up double lung and artery that was a good hit all right so no point in looking at anything with her because she's just female, so let's sell her. 
it counts. Guys, it counts. That is amazing news. That means... That means we know where our wolf packs are, guys. We know where the wolf pack is. And now we can get that mission out of the way. And we can unlock the, uh, the last bit of mountains that we can hunt, which is amazing. So we have the Regina Mountains. We have Door Apex, which are mountain areas. And then we have the Adank Expanse. And this is a uh, huge set of mountains that I would absolutely love to get into and hunt. I got a feeling this is where we're going to see our big Mouflon and our big chamois right in there. So we need to go pick up our second Mouflon here. And then maybe what I'll do is try to hunt down that wolf pack. Now that I know that it doesn't have to be in the, uh, the Regina Mountains area, that's kind of strange because, you know, as you can see right there, it says harvest two female wolves in the Regina Mountain. So, uh, yeah, I just assumed that it had to be in that area. So glad it didn't have to be. So glad. Okay, so now we are trying to find our Mouflon. That's a lot of blood right there. That was definitely a good hit. Look at that. Wow. Lots of blood. That's one of the first times I've seen that actually say lots of blood and time to expire fast. So that... It's fantastic. That is what you like to see. And like I said, I'm almost certain he's, yeah, he is. He's right there, guys. Look at the colorings on these Mouflon. I actually love that. Look at that. We got Mouflon. Ooh. I'm sure these are probably the same Mouflon, but... I'm surprised that those chamois don't come down here as well because they were headed down this way. And like I said, we spooked them. Now the question is, did we kill the right one? Left lung, right lung. Beautiful shot. Went right to the bone. That, uh, that 308, man, that does the job. Yeah, we did. He was the one star mature, so we did hit the right one. Oh, man, I thought I heard wolves in the background. Okay, let's sell him. There we go. All right, guys, so I think what I'm going to do next, I'm going to go and I'm going to see if I can catch up to our wolf pack. Um, you know, I hate to take out two females in the same wolf pack, but at the same time, that's literally the only wolf pack I've seen. So, yeah, I'm really thinking I have no choice. Okay, this is the second time I've caught up to this wolf pack now. Um, the second time, uh, this is the third time actually. Uh, the second time I took a shot at this female right here. And completely missed her. Ooh. I think we missed her. Um, I took a shot on her while she was moving, and that was just a, a bonehead idea. But uh, they just won't stop moving. So I guess the only plan of attack is to kind of follow them until they do stop moving and then take a shot. I mean, yeah, she was a little further out and she was not really quartered. I mean, it to me, it looked like a decent shot. So I don't know how we missed exactly, but uh, we did. You know, I'm just, uh, I'm just a little on edge here because I want to get this mission done so we can hunt those northern mountains. Usually every time... You hunt a new uh, a new spot that was private. You get a uh, at least one five star. So the predators, man, it seems like the predators act differently than 
the antler species, which is good. I, I like that. That's uh, that's fine. But I mean, it's like they're definitely going back the way we came, which I'm not used to that kind of thing. But also, we have a pretty big herd of mouflon out over that way somewhere on one of those mountainsides that I thought if I couldn't catch up to these wolves, I would I would go check them out. But fortunately, we did check up on these wolves, and uh, we'll not check up on them, but the funny thing is, I have not heard them. Like, they kind of slinked right past me very quietly, and uh, I, I did not hear them, so this is becoming quite, quite the hunt. I'm honestly not sure even how much I'm going to leave of this in the video because this video is slowly becoming part two of a mountain hunt and it's becoming more of a uh, of a wolf hunt. Hmm. Are they kind of settling on this area? But as you can see, they just, they rarely stand still. They rarely stand still, and it makes it difficult. We are at a good distance from them, though. So they are converging in that spot. Or are they just regrouping? No, no, no. It seems like they're doing something there. I have no idea what. I mean, at this point, I wish they either just lay down or do something. So there's our mature female. Now I don't know where she is. It's it's so hard to tell, man. It's so hard to tell. Okay, that's our mature female right there. Oh my god, where did she go now? Are they moving off again? Ah, gosh. They're all acting like my dog Dakota, man. They just won't sit still. They won't calm down, young female. Adult female. There's a mature female right there. I guess it really doesn't matter which female we take as long as it's a female. Say, I would prefer. God, there she is right there. I feel like it's her in the background.
Why won't they stop walking? <laughs> this is nerve wracking. Oh, I'm out of bullets. Holy crap, I'm out of bullets. Oh boy. So now that means we got to take her out. Wait, what is this even? Oh no. Oh no. This just went from horrible to worse, guys. I don't have a gun to take her out. I'm all out of bullets. <laughs> Third 308. Oh no, and that means I have to go. Ah, God, okay. Oh boy, guys, this is, this is becoming something. I actually think this is going to be the next video. I think we'll do the mountains in a, a three-part video here. Uh, we'll unlock this, and then in the next video, we will hunt in that locked area. So I had to go all the way back to the cabin, and I had to replenish my ammo. But uh, we are back, and they're still there, thankfully. They're still just moving around way too much for my liking. Um, boy, a spotting scope. You know, I know I sound like a broken record, but really, if I had a spotting scope right now, I could easily take them out from this distance. But I just have no idea which one is our female. So it's unfortunate, but unfortunately, that's what we have to work with. Let's uh, let's get rid of this here. There we go. Boy, they're still just non-stop circling. That's the kind of part that's... Uh, Making this all the more difficult, I guess. Because let's face it, taking taking a moving shot is risky anyway. But in this game, where I can, you know, highlight the animal, which is fine with me because that's not realistic. You can't highlight animals in, in real life. But uh, man, it makes it really tricky in this game because I just had no idea which one of these is the one we want and they just won't stop moving they will not stop I thought maybe coming back from this way the wind would be a little better but it's actually not <laughs> ah there we go there we go adult female there's our mature female right there So I did, uh, I did equip the other scope. I, th I think that's her. But I have no idea. Well, whatever it is, it's down. God, I really hope that's a female. That's all I care about really at this point. I don't really care if it's the mature. I don't care if it's a young. I just wanted this to be the female down so we can go back and we can get this mission done and we can unlock that other area. Alright, so she's just up over this little ridge here, and uh, well, let's cross our fingers that she is a she, and we hit one of the right ones. 
Heart, left lung, right lung. That was a good shot. Please, please, please. Oh, we got the right one, guys. This is the mature female. Let's go. All right. We're going to sell her. There we go. And we did it. Awesome. Let's go back. So, guys, this isn't exactly the video I intended to do today. But, uh, you know, I'm kind of glad that we did it. I'm kind of glad that I brought you on the journey with me. Um, maybe you're having issues with this same one, and maybe you thought the same thing I did. Maybe you thought that the wolf had to be harvested in the Regina Mountains, and uh, now we, uh, we all know that it can be harvested uh, pretty much anywhere. So let's see here. Oh my god, we have another one to do? That was only the second mission. We haven't unlocked it yet. Oh my god. There's one old and already injured wolf in the mountains missing one eye. I have been following him for a few years now and have named him Aldo. I've grown too close to him now and I can't believe him in his pain. Please help me. So it looks like we're going to have to get one more wolf, guys. Oh no. Harvest Aldo, the 12-year-old black wolf missing one eye in the mountains. Ooh, a black wolf, though. Gosh. I mean, you know what? We're in this deep. We might as well do it. All right, so we're in the, uh, the little highlighted area, but it has the exclamation mark in the middle of it. And now, the thing is, I don't think I want to really get right down there to where the exclamation mark is, but... Maybe we have to trigger it. I would like to stay higher up on these guys because, again, hunting wolves is very tricky. And if you kind of get on their level, it makes it even more difficult. So I almost didn't want to do that. But like I say, I don't know. This mission, uh, it may only trigger once you get into the specific area where the exclamation mark is. I know I've had a couple that were like that. The, uh, the black bear mission, it was a lot easier. Like, literally, I came right into his territory, and he was pretty much right there. But I gotta say, I am very interested to see this black wolf. You know, I, uh, I kind of enjoy these, these types of missions because... It kind of gives us a glimpse into the future of what the uh, the rares and uh, the unique kind of animals may look like in the game. So yeah, it's it's pretty cool, and I think it's pretty cool that they uh, they put these in the story as well. So let's see here, how far are we away? Ooh, all right, guys, so after a while of searching, we have finally found our guy. There he is right there. Two-star adult male. That has to be Aldo. It's kind of hard to see if he's black or not. I believe he is. So, uh, let's get ready to take this dude out. And we got him. One shot, baby. <laughs> yeah, there we go. So, I I didn't mount the black uh, bighorn sheep. And I kind of regret not doing that. So, I think we're definitely going to mount this guy. Just because, as of right now, they're the only rares in the game. It's a shame that they're mission animals, but... Like I said, the uh, the developers, they uh, they're aware that we want it, and they did say that they are going to give us rare and unique animals in an update in the future. So I can't wait for that. That's going to bring so much to the game. But uh, for right now, man, this is uh, this is the only way we can kind of get a glimpse at any kind of rare or unique or fur variant animals. Um, and, you know, leave in the comments, guys, what do you think when they say rare and unique? I mean, obviously, 
careers are probably going to be like albinos, uh, melanistic, possibly piebald. Um, which do you think is going to fall under the unique category? Do you think that's going to be different fur variants? Do you think that's going to be um, non-typical racks? Like, uh, what do you think they mean by that? What do you think we're going to get? Oh, my God. They really need to fix this. They really need to fix this because this is so difficult trying to climb these mountains. All right, so we had to kind of go up and around here to get to him, but here he is right here. Oh, wow. He looks so cool. You can see the scarred eye. Let's uh, try to get a decent shot here without <laughs> falling down the hill. All right, so let's uh, let's claim him here. We got him in left lung, right lung, and artery. Very good shot. <laughs> he went right down. Very cool looking animal. Very cool looking. I would love to see more of these added to the game, man. I really would. So we are going to taxidermy him. And uh. I think we put him out of his misery because it couldn't be comfortable wandering around with that that eye. I'm surprised it didn't get infected and he hasn't passed away already. All right, guys. So we're going to go back to the cabin. And, uh, well, wait a minute. <laughs> Before we do that, are any of these decent? Probably not. Yeah, they're not. Okay. All right. So here we are back at the cabin. Let's go in here and hopefully get her permission to hunt the land. Thank you. Yes. Ethical behavior is doing the right thing when no one else is watching. Even when doing the wrong thing is legal. Aldo Leopold, you made me proud and gave me a lot of motivation and inspiration for new chapters in my book. You've earned my trust and respect. Please enjoy and always respect natural resources, other hunters, landowners, and non-hunters. Awesome. So now we have permission to hunt the northern mountain range. We are going to be doing that in the next video, guys. But before we leave, we are going to go back to the lodge. And we are going to mount our black wolf. But that is if we have the cash to do it. That's, uh, that's something we have to think about here. We should have. Yeah, yeah, we should. So... Four gray wolves lying and sitting. Gray wolf attacking a fleeing wild boar. Hmm. Let's just see where we want him here. Because I do like that. I think we'll put him... Right there. There we go. And there he is. There's there's old Eldo, man. Let's uh, go into photo mode and take a look at him. Yeah, I think they did that model pretty good. I think it looks halfway decent. I like the fact that he's got the scar in his eye. And he's just a very unique looking animal. Very cool looking indeed. All right, guys. So, again, like I said, it's not exactly what I planned for today's hunt. But uh, you know what? All in all, I'd say it went pretty good. All right, guys. So, that's old Eldo. He's looking really good up there. I love what they did with that model. Um, that's where we're going to end this video for today. Thank you so much for watching. hope you're having a fantastic day. I hope you're enjoying Way of the Hunter as much as I am. We'll see you next time. But until then, happy hunting, guys.